So I want to start with that really touching tribute the Prime Minister gave to Frank McGovern, the last surviving veteran of the HMAS Perth, which was sunk by the Japanese during World War II. And a prisoner of war twice, and I didn't realise, but he'd actually survived yet another uh, incident, a Japanese destroyer sunk. So an extraordinary life, uh, 103. And uh, the Prime Minister detailed how he met him just last month. Uh, I know Frank McGovern's family is very grateful to the Prime Minister for uh, for taking the time to meet him uh, one Saturday, just shortly before Anzac Day. And, uh, yeah, the PM there had some very kind words uh, for this only survivor of HMAS Perth, former prisoner of war, uh, who lived to 103 years of age. Let's uh, hear him. Yeah, and, you know, he told him that the answer to long life was a bottle of wine a day and insisted he share a beer. Uh, had his rooster scarf on, I hear, during this exchange with uh, and, and giving a bit of curry to Anthony Albanese, wearing the mask there, taking the precautions, the South mask. So there it is. There's the beer. Here's what the PM said just after question time. About I had the extraordinary privilege of meeting with Frank on the 22nd of April, just before Anzac Day uh, this year. And it was covered by uh, the Daily Telegraph that day. Um, he was at that time at the Eastern Suburbs Private Hospital. He was a bit upset because Frank, at 103 years of age, uh, was still living at home by himself and cooking for himself. He told me the secret to life a long life was he drank a bottle of wine every day. <laughs> Frank McGovern, what a life and uh, rest in peace to a, a great Australian.